How's it going? I hope you're all doing well. Um, I'm going to make this short video today. It's going to be a short one. Uh, I want to let you know that this is a date. Um, I've been making a lot of videos. I don't like making videos. But people people have been sending me stuff. And uh, I do appreciate everybody. Everybody. All of you. And as I said yesterday about RJ. RJ sent me something. And uh, I didn't put it out yesterday because everybody's sending me stuff and there's so much stuff going on right now. It's like we're close. We could leave the 27th. I will go over this right now, the 28th. As I said in my dream, and I had this, it was a vision. I say a dream, dream, but it, it, I mean, I don't know, whatever, dream, vision, it doesn't really matter. But uh, people are sending stuff. I appreciate you if... If you sent me some and I haven't put it out yet, it's not because I'm uh, neglecting you. It's not that you, what you gave me wasn't important. It's just that there's so much stuff going on right now. Um, I'd rather be talking about uh, seeking the Lord daily and that kind of stuff than making videos like this So and other ones. I mean, um, I'd rather be talking about the Bible and stuff like that. Actually, um, my beautiful sister said something to me about talking about jewels, and it's not that I'm, I would rather talk about stuff like that, but um, there's just so much stuff going on right now, and we're so close. Just keep in your prayer closet and prayer daily, and uh, like I said, I love you all. Here's the date. Um, yes, I subscribed to, subscribe to my brother Bob Barber right here, um, and Here's what he said, and uh, this is how close we are. From this comet, and grazed the electromagnetic field of Mars, and when they touched, well, you saw what just happened. Now, what I'm going to show you next is the actual footage of this event taking place, and the man is going to be speaking. Like I said, this is exactly as my vision I had. guys get the idea i do plasma bolt pretty funny because he said bob was saying uh he's the first one to show you this information well that's it was pretty funny because when i say it no bob i saw it i saw it in a vision that be electrical dis di discharge between the comet and mars so there's there's no sense of me going over this because Bob does a beautiful job, and, and I saw it, and I was like, yeah, yeah, Bob, I've seen it before. <laughs> anyway, then um, here it is right here. This is on my brother's channel right here, World Report right here. It's right there. That is not Mars. That is not Mars. See how big it is? Uh NASA's saying that's Mars. He even says that there's no way that's Mars. The last time they showed Mars, it streaked across the top of the screen, and it was like a little dot. That is not Mars. That's it right there. So it's coming. Also right here, fireballs. I have... 2021, 11 a.m. Central here in the U.S. God bless you and yours. No matter where you are in the world, folks, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Ring that bell for critical future updates. Well, folks, we're obviously in some sort of debris field. We had another seven fireballs explode over just the United States since midnight last night to dawn this morning. I checked that out. Yes, he's correct. Um... There was all kinds of them going off in Canada, exactly when he said this. This has been happening a lot lately. Uh, he had another video with nine of them. So I wanted to bring that to everybody's Seven attention. Seven more fireballs. The all-sky fireball So net. I wanted to go over that. Then... This right here. My brother brought this to my attention. This is, uh, 
I didn't know this. This is um this is Musha right here. This is Musha's wife. I didn't know she had a new channel. She had a new channel. The one I was showing you was her old channel and she made a new one. So right here when Musha was saying the new moon It's called Ancient Past right here. Well, what is significance about this? Right here, she had a Zoom meeting with the rabbis in Israel. Okay, so... Here so they are right here. Uh, will you share the, the link with us? Yeah, I will. I will. Uh, it, it may not get published maybe for another week, okay? And, and we'll get more into that as, as I go along. The reason, the reason that I've asked you guys to join me tonight is because basically I have decided what our house will do as far as Passover when we will celebrate it. And I'm going to explain to you and show you today why I've decided this. And then I'm going to ask you, as men well read in the Bible, if you can see any reason, not traditions that we've been taught. I'm speaking of any right. biblical reason that we're looking at that I cannot or I should not say to the rest of the world which is always my platform. I never say, this is what you should do. I say, me and my house, we will be doing this. And this is why we will be doing it. So as men well-versed in, in, in those scriptures concerning the, the year, I've asked you to come together with me and look at my evidence and um, tell me, give me some feedback tonight. I would actually like you to take a week and pray and we'll meet back together next week on a secondary Zoom because, you know. So she was talking to the religious leaders in Israel, inspecting the barley. She did this on January 22nd because she knows that the barley is going to be early, a month early, which would be 13 months. So she went to the rabbis and she talked to them, religious leaders in Israel, and talk to them about starting the calendar early. Which every year it isn't early. So, then she went out here. She went out here and looked. Okay, I couldn't help it. I couldn't help it. I had to come in here and check. I want you to look at On the, the change night. of these areas from Saturday when I was in here. Look at the color of the ons. Look at the color of the ons. Look at how white they are. Look at how brittle they are. Did you see how easy that pulled away? I don't even really have to check the inside of this. When that releases like that. See, she took. She looked at it on 9th of February. So she looked at it on 9th of February. And if it would have lasted another month, it would have fell on the ground and rotted. So on the night she checked it. You can look at these videos yourself. Then she went out and she spotted the new moon. Hi guys. Someone asked for a live of the new moon. There it is at 5.30. So, Rosh Hodash Shmicha, Shana Tova, Veshana Matuka. So, Happy New Moon, Happy New Year, Sweet New Year. And you so, I just found out this information. She had What she did, she changed her channel name like some people do. She wanted to name it uh, uh, Ancient Past New Moon. That's what she named her channel. And then just yesterday, so in other words, the month started February, as I said, a month early, the 13th month. Then yesterday she met with this rabbi right here, 
Zoom meeting. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. So these last two years with, with this <laughs> abundant rain. Yes. We've had two flushes of barley. Yes. Uh, much tonight, but uh, <laughs> I'm committed to the fact that we're in great shape. That, that... So she goes over everything beautiful. He says here about the wave sheaf offering and talks about it. She He talks in this video right here at the end. If you want to read it or listen to it, you use the barley that you get. You use the barley that you get for Pesach. You give your you give your offering to the Lord. You give your offering to the Lord, and then you use the Pesach to make your uh, Passover bread, your un your unleavened bread out of the barley that you harvested, you just harvested, not old. You make barley flour, and then you make your Pesach out of it to do to do your Passover. So you give the Lord his part, then you give, then you make the, the Passover, um, your unleavened bread out of the barley. She talks about it in this video. This is her channel right here. You can go over all this stuff. So as I said, February 14th, the 13th was the first month. So I don't want to hear anybody say anything about any other calendars or whatever, because it's wrong. It's, a, it's off the Bible. So love you all. We have our own opinion. You can have your opinion too. Yes. But like I said, this did come true. This is coming true. So I wanted to have a short video. Hope you're all doing well. And uh, like I said, I'm going to, um, this is a very informational video. Love you all. And uh, I'm just going to be praising the Lord today. And uh, like you are too. And uh, yeah, I will make another video about, uh, you know, like I said, there's just so much stuff going on right now. Hope you're all doing well. Thank you. Bye.